Welcome back to Quake Champions, ladies and gentlemen. A very much patched Quake Champions, that is. The December and January patches have brought so many changes affecting movement mechanics that I decided to split these up into several videos. Let's begin with Clutch, the undisputed champion of speed. The jumps you see right now were done before the December patch. Back then, our robot's dodge ability, triggered by double tapping a movement key, had a cooldown. So, you only could get the dodge speed boost every second jump or so. In December, the cooldown was removed, meaning that now we can get the boost on every jump. In other words, the dodge now resets on every ground contact, which makes things a lot easier and a lot faster. Now, you can go from Mega to Teleport, like that. There are some finer points though. For example, you can jump and delay the first dodge boost until descending and nearly hitting the floor. That way, you can immediately dodge again and get a big speed boost within short time and distance. In Burial Chamber alone, there are many many new routes possible now. Enjoy the following collection, and after that, we will speed things up even more. Way more. For everything from now on, a big shout out goes to Chaplot, aka New Star. You'll find a link to his video in the description. Stair dashing exploits the geometry of stairs found in the map. Going upstairs means repeatedly losing and regaining contact with the ground. On every contact, the dodge boost is reset and can immediately be used again. But we cannot double tap that fast. Hence, just for the fun of it, bind forward and backward to your mouse wheel. Just enjoy and I'll explain in detail in a minute. <laughs> The idea is to begin with facing up stairs. 
point in the direction you want to travel. Now begin to scroll and as you go up the stairs, scroll ever faster. You accelerate while going up the stairs and the time between ground contacts becomes shorter and shorter. So the double taps have to come ever faster to get optimal acceleration. While you scroll, keep away from your regular forward key. Now we can all go to infinity and beyond. But is it a bug or a feature? We shall see. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you after respawn.